Hello everyone, my name is Lakshman Rao and today I am going to talk about the Meta Engineering Manager interview process. At the end of this video, you should have a good understanding of the process itself, what interviews look at and a bunch of tips for each round. Quick intro, I am from Prepfully. This video has been put together by Meta Engineering Managers who are also interview coaches on Prepfully. They have coached hundreds of candidates successfully and are available on the website for direct booking if you're looking for more personalized guidance. Right then, moving on to the interview, it typically consists of three rounds. First, a phone screening. Second, an interview with an engineering manager. And third, the on-site round consisting of five to six interviews. Let's look at each of these closely. So you will start off with a phone screen with a meta recruiter. This is basically an icebreaker to get to know you better and understand your background. I have three tips for this round. It usually begins with the tell me about yourself prompt. So make sure you have a crisp and concise overview of yourself ready. Second, have a clear reason for why you are applying at meta as well as why you think you would succeed there. Lastly, Think ahead and narrow down specific projects you'd like to discuss, basically to give insight into what your contribution was, how things went, and what you learned. Next will be an interview with an engineering manager, which is divided into two parts and takes about 45 to 60 minutes. I have three tips for this round. During the first part of the interview, your goal will be to demonstrate your people management and leadership prowess. So think ahead and craft engaging narratives that highlight instances. For instance, where you have led, mentored, or guided teams to achieve meaningful outcomes. Here, it is important to emphasize how your leadership approach contributed to cohesion growth and success. The second part of the interview will focus more on the technical aspects. But keep in mind that it's not just about showcasing your technical chops. Meta is interested in candidates who can apply their technical expertise strategically. So when discussing past technical projects, delve into the architectural decisions you made, the challenges you overcame, and the innovative solutions you implemented. Go beyond the technical details and share how your decisions aligned with broader project goals and contributed to overall business success. As is evident, practice is key to nailing this round. We recommend practicing with a friend or a professional mock interviewer. Ideally, a meta engineering manager, you can find several on Prepfully. This will help you replicate the pressure and dynamics of an actual interview. You will also get detailed feedback after each practice session to identify areas for improvement and refine your performance. You can book a one-on-one -on -one session with a Meta Engineering Manager using the link in the description below. Right then, that's about the second round. Finally, we have the on-site interviews and these are a whole different ballgame. It's where the real assessment happens. You will have around five to six separate 45-minute interviews with different interviewers from Meta. You will face one or two system design interviews where you will be asked to demonstrate your ability to architect solutions. Next, there will be a project retrospective interview that will dive into your past experiences and your problem-solving mindset. Then, there's a deep dive into people management or a technical project. That is where you really get to shine. You will also have one or two coding interviews to flex your coding muscles. Last but not least, there's a culture fit interview to see if you vibe well with the meta ethos. Now, I have five tips for the on-site round. To start with, make sure you are well-versed in architectural concepts and can design solutions that handle heavy workloads. So let's say you are asked to design a real-time messaging system for a social media platform. You should discuss how you would architect the system 
to handle high concurrency, ensure data consistency, and provide low latency communication. Make sure you use diagrams to illustrate components like message queues, databases, and load balancers. Lastly, justify your design choices, such as the selection of specific technologies or trade-offs between performance and cost. Next, during the people management interview, focus on your leadership abilities and how you handle managerial scenarios. Let them know how you have steered teams through tricky scenarios, provided guidance, inspired motivation. This one is all about displaying your commitment to supporting and uplifting your team. Next, onto the culture fit interview. It gauges how well you align with Meta's values. Here, you need to share personal and professional experiences that showcase your compatibility with Meta's work culture. Make sure you emphasize your adaptability, teamwork, and ability to work in a dynamic environment. Lastly, for the coding round, make sure you walk your interviewers through a step-by-step -step approach from optimizing the algorithm's time and space complexity to providing a clean and well-structured code in your preferred programming language. And most importantly, articulate your thought process all the way. Our best piece of advice for all the on-site interviews is to practice them with a meta engineering manager who's been in your shoes or an interview coach who has insight and experience. Because this isn't just about practicing, it's about mimicking the real interview atmosphere. The pressure, the dynamics, it's all there. The invaluable feedback after your session will really help fine-tune your skills. You can book a mock interview with a Meta Engineering Manager on Preferly using the link in the description below. Well, that's all from me. Don't forget to check out our more in-depth written guide in the video description and book a slot with Preferly Software Engineer Coaches for personalized guidance. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe. Our website is prepfully.com. We've got lots of interview questions there. You can also schedule a mock interview with one of our experts. You can find the link in the description below. All the best from us at Prepfully, and we hope you totally rock your interview.